Hey everybody, CK here, and I am here with a video that has been requested a lot, and I figured, you know what? I could show you better than I could tell you. So I'm gonna show you my nail routine. So let's get in it. These are some of my favorite items, except this right here, okay? This is all they had at Rite Aid. If you follow me on Snapchat, then you saw this whole situation. I really don't like the sponge that comes in this one. I prefer the little scrubby things, but I didn't wanna show you my old busted one, okay? <laughs> so this product right here, I will try to find a link, but I don't even know where I got it from. Now this is a brush to clean up. That's my favorite nail polish, and this is, oh my gosh, we're moving so fast. But anyway, I'll explain as we go, okay? So just get any old nail file, and this right here, yeah, man down. I don't know. It did it right before I did the video. So I'm just filing it to the shape that I would like, and now I'm opening up this nail polish remover. I love using acetone because it does a lot of the work for you, but this sponge, not so great, okay? I really like Sephora's Delete All. It gets the job done like in one dip, all right? So just get the rest of that nail polish off if you have to, and that's all I'm doing. I put some of that acetone on the paper towel, and now I'm using this utensil. I don't even know what it's called, but I'm using it to push my cuticles back and to get any dead skin from around that area, any, you know, just any excess residue, whatever. And then I flipped it over and I'm just like scraping all that off, okay? And then sometimes as you're doing that, you may run into a little doohickey like this right here. It's a little more skin right there. So I just kind of dug it up a little bit and then I grabbed these other utensils. I don't even know the names of these, you guys, because listen, I'm not a cosmetologist. But anyway, I use that to kind of clip away that skin and then I'm proceeding to take all of the rest of the, you know, the skin, the residue, all that good stuff. I'm just taking it off. And now here is what gets the work done. It gets the job done so I don't really have to do it. This is a cuticle remover. It dissolves all of that excess, excess, I always say excess, excess skin. And so it says to leave it on there for 15 seconds, y'all. But I've been doing this for a minute. I leave it on for about a minute, okay? And so I wash my hands real good, scrub it as I'm washing them. And now we're gonna go on with this base coat. This is also a nail strengthener. You guys, I swear by this, it is so bomb and it keeps my nails strong. I use it every time I do my manicure and I usually do my manicures once a week unless they're just really chipping or I use a nail polish that's not so great, okay? Now my favorite nail polishes are Julie G, Simple Colors, and Milani Color Statement. But we're gonna go with the Simple Colors today because I just, I'm not feeling blue, but I'm feeling the color blue. You feel me? <laughs> so anyway, I'm just painting my nails and I am not a pro, you guys. I just know how to clean it up real, real good. So when you see my manis on Snap and in my videos, don't think we just started off all fresh and cute. No, we gotta do cleanup. Clean up on our seven, just kidding. But anyway, so I'm just painting that and I've gotten really good at doing my left hand, I mean my right hand with my left hand as well, but it's not as good as when I use my right hand, okay? But that's all I'm doing. I usually do two coats and then I take this brush. This is a Sonia Kashuk brush, but I've had it for years, so I don't even know what the number is. I would try to find that as well. And I just clean it up. And then I've been using this top coat by HK, or no, it's by Glisten and Glow, but it's called HK. This is better than Sechevite. This is better than any top coat that I've ever tried. And so I'll put the link to that as well. And that is the final look, you guys. That's all I do, and they last for a whole week. So that's it. Make sure you check out this video. And in a minute, another video will pop up. Make sure you share, you guys. Like this video if you enjoyed it or if it helped you in any way because it really helps the channel. And don't forget to join the fam bam, okay? Because you can never have too many family members, all right? I would love to have you guys. You guys have an awesome, blessed day. And I will see you sooner than you think. Bye. And for those of y'all that be grooving to the CK Beauty song, here you go. Siki Beauty, confidence is key. You know what I mean. A woman feels good when she's looking pretty. I don't need no Benz, Lexus, or a Range Rover. Just give your girl a bomb Siki Beauty makeover. Confidence is key, ladies. You know what I mean. Or maybe her eyeshadow and mascara will help you see. Check out her foundation and the blush on her cheek. Yeah, we ain't playing games. It's the Siki Beauty. Yeah, Siki Beauty.